Hi guys, welcome to the release of a new application called Sofirem. And if we type in Sofirem, or in short, Sophie, and Sophie is a nice uh, first name, then you get a application that does this. Now, if you just type it here, you get the name where it comes from. Software Installer Remover, Sophie. REM, software installer remover, or also in my head, software reminder. Because why is this here? Because you asked for it. You asked to us, can we, after installation and after rebooting, can we launch Calamaris so we can select these tools? You have a lot of tools in Calamaris. And if we forgot one and we don't know the name, we can't install them. And yes, of course, there is PAMAC, the PAMAC installer, right? But if you don't know the name, then still, you don't know what to select. So these guys, this application is built on the files of Calamaris. So if you could install it in Calamaris, you can now also install it in SophieRAM. And you'll notice that there's more or less the same um, distinction. If you want to install something about communication, you have communication here and then connect remotely. And you can select things like this and say, okay, I'm gonna install code and just a click away and everything installs, but it's already installed, I see, because there is already something running. There's Visual Studio Codebin that's in there. And why is that? Not because this is XL, because I just made a video about ButterFS. So if you see it, the numbering, so one image, when one number less, you'll see I've made a video about ButterFS and I've installed Arclix Get Nemesis. So a script that runs the stuff that I need. There is not one distro that's perfect. So this is going to remove everything I don't want. And this is going to install all the things I want. And this is going to rise the way I like it when I am on Reborn OS, when I'm Garuda, when I'm on Endeavor OS, when I'm Big Linux and so on. Archman, all the guys are here. Because in the end, it's all Arch Linux, whatever it's called. So you can decide to install some more stuff. Um, maybe you should have a look at the Arc theming. So at this point in time, there's just one installed, Arc Dawn, which is a kind of blue thing, but I've changed it back to Arc Dark. And uh, I could go to something yellow. So Arc Numix, the Numix folders are yellow folders. So if you go for that, you have a selection. You go here, you go there and everything can be selected if you want in here. And then the icons, let's take the new mix icons as well with the circle arc. And there you go. A completely different look and different, different uh, icons. Icons are, well, it's a choice, right? <laughs> you choose what you like, but I think this one would be better. Circle light would be better. And then we see, uh, no, still, these guys are still the way they are. Choices. So there you go. You have um, a new application called SophieRem. There, here's the communication. There is, of course, lots more to tell. But let's uh, first make this launch video. So have a go with it, look at it. And the one thing that I should explain a little bit more is the button up there. I can do it now or later, but this is also interesting. This play package version is this. Is this necessary or not? It's up to you to decide if you want that or not. By default, it's not on. If you're somewhere else, you can import a key ring. You can import Arclex mirror lists. If you're on another system, this package can get everything in because that's, of course, important. You can't install Arclinix stuff on Arch or on Garuda or on DevOS and so on. So you need to have the keys. Let's have a look. This is okay. Some kind of fighter. And um, you have something more. Let's open the Pacman log file is here. Display package progress window on or off. Show installed packages. That's a nice little, uh, well, overlook and look of, of what you have rather than having pseudo pacman minus q this is what you have in a nice window so you know what you have installed maybe you can use it at some point in time 
and explore Arch Linux ISO packages and about SoFiRAM. This is explore Arch Linux ISO. So all our ISOs are here. If you say what's on Arco i3, it just gets a list from the GitHub. So basically you don't have to type in github.com slash Arch Linux slash and so on. And this is the list, the packages list. It goes actually through the file the, on which we create the ISO. This is the file with which we create the ISO. So there you go. That's going to go on the ISO, which is not fair at some point in time, because in here are also the stuff that we need for Calamaris. And yes, we won't keep those things around if you're not on Plasma. If you're on Plasma, these things will be, well, stay around, right? So you see and have a look. Um, that's an OK. And that's it, basically. Explore Arclinx ISO package, show install packages, open Pacman log file, maybe. Have a look at the, you know where all the log files are, var log. That's why you need to go through an R, var log, which is computer <coughs> var log. Take a look here. And basically, we just show you what's in there. But I do believe if we install things, this, this gets updated, if I'm not mistaken. So we can have a look. So if we do Arc theming and we take the blue one, we click on the blue one. Uh huh. There we go. And this gets indeed updated. And you see that we're on Sofri Rem. I can't drag this thing. So a little bit out of scope here, but Arc Arc Linux here and everything is changed 65, 66. So that's the hint that we're on ButterFS. And now I can change. So off it goes again. So it's an installer and a remover, both of them. So everything that has a blue, well, in this case, yellow thing. And you say, don't want to have Discord anymore. Discord is now removed. Now it's as smart as Pacman is. What do I mean by that? If you can't remove it because Pacman says no, and then it's no. It's simple as that, right? So these things are always related on the fact that can Pacman do it? Can he install it? Are there conflicts? Yes, no. But it'll see a pop up like you saw in the beginning. It was red. I said, no, it's not possible. And it's back. So there you go. Have a look at it. Development file managers. These are all the things you can select in Calamaris. And some of them will take a bit longer, like gaming, for instance. I was just thinking about the game Xenotic. It's one gigabyte to download. So do know your packages. slider remember the sliders or just maximize it don't see a slider anymore nvidia stuff watch out with drivers but you're smart you know what to do office is here terminals are here terminal fun ascii aquarium maybe you never installed this little thing ascii aquarium good for guys three four or five years old maybe and put them in front of a computer and then show them this little fishies and a little boat and sometimes a shark passes and it's always something different so there you go theming utilities vm just have a look at it and see if there is something in there you say hmm, i like to have that one if anything goes wrong it is still in in, in development so discord is the place to post anything and if it's not already there, I don't think it is, not officially anyway, then we'll make a channel to report any of the issues or wishes maybe that you have. All right, enjoy Sofirem. Cheers.